Just a few, uh, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit of framey droppies going on there. I think it's smoothed out. Hopefully, nope, nope. That's that's doing it again. Seems to be an internet thing, which is the worst thing for it to be because I can't fix that. <laughs> Fuck my life. <laughs> uh, eh. kind of just. I guess we'll just deal with it. I don't know. All I can do is apologize. If it if it ends up being a pain in the buttocks, then I'll give you my screen. Yeah, I'm sorry. Hello, anyway. Uh I got in the mood for Star Wars, so I guess we're doing more Star Wars. But uh I didn't really wanna I guess I didn't want to do any more new stuff. <laughs> So, I thought it'd be fun to refresh my memory on the old stuff. So, we'll see how that goes. With the uh, Jedi Knight first, because I felt like doing the Jedi Knight first. I've made a character. I've got him all suited and booted. Never mind, the stream's off. That's fine. Oh, looks like the internet thing is here too. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Why? You, you can look at this, I don't. It's fine. Uh, Alright, 
fingers crossed. That's it. That's that's the bad shit done with. The fingers they are crossed. No. Try this again, shall we? And then you say the second time's the charm. I don't know that I believe them. Turn my volume down a little bit. All right, space bar in. Yeah, I've already made a dude. Uh, I buggered off to my stronghold and got him some armor as well. So he doesn't come here looking like a pleb. I'm pure blood. Slip so pure blood. This old Jedi must be. Doesn't seem like it's the way, but it's the way. I think we're gonna be mostly light side, maybe differ a little bit here and there. A little bit of smugness, maybe. But not yet. Not too much smugness. Well, I'm eager to get started, sir. Hello, Mr. Buff. Yeah. Mm, yeah, trouble. Yeah, why, why me? Alright, sir. I got this. I can do this. I believe in me. Come, BD, RE, whatever you want to be called. Come, little dude. Yes, yes. There is no better minion. Oof, I do love Typhon. He's very pretty. Go, go, I must save the people and stuff. You understand, droid? I got it, so cool. <laughs> So cool. Oh, I right. best switch these on because I do intend to do them. I should say if you've not played before, this little button basically switches on. How dare you? Switches on the uh, side quests. They're switched off by default. Uh, I don't feel like I've ever been over here. Hello. Also, hello to your twin. Do I have anything? Yeah, take my med kits. I ain't gonna use them. Uh, I've already chosen my second class. Uh, I chose Jedi Shadow, because that seemed like fun. Uh, yeah, that's why I'm here, buddy. I got it. I'm on this. Don't worry, don't worry. 
I'm on it like a speeder bonnet. But I get you. You're a master, sir. Believe in yourself. What do you think, Ari? We got this. We got this, Ari. You we have. Endurable little shit. Alright, any more quests? No. Good. We'll do this. Oh, they changed tagging, didn't they? Nice. Well, be nice if I can get a hit. <laughs> One second. Uh, oh, hi. There we go. A little, little laggy there. Uh, where's that? I'm gonna read the card access to you, so if that's not you, Jazz. I'm so sorry. But I've never, I've never really read them before. That's a lie. I think I've read them on this, uh, this planet. But still, Denals. Denals is a name given to the wilds near the outposts and landing pads beneath the Master's Retreat. It was nicknamed for the thick undergrowth that originally covered the region, which took several months to clear. The original explorers of Typhon discovered and restored ruined stone paths and bridges leading through the Nals, suggesting these wilds were once used by the ancient Jedi. Although still a proving ground for pa uh, Jedi Padawans, in recent years the Nals has become increasingly dangerous. Wild animals has be have begun migrating closer to the Nals outpost, and there have been sightings of Typhon's native flesh raiders in neighboring sectors. The Jedi Council is in discussion about moving the training grounds to a safer region. But many masters feel that the risk is necessary at a certain level of tutelage. The galaxy is dangerous, and Jedi can be shielded there to be prepared. I don't know that that's a good idea. <laughs> uh, that's some silly shit. How dare he interrupt me while I'm reading. Utter cheek. The utter cheek of it all. Get down. Get up. Get down. Get all around. I said get up. Get down. Get all around. Oh, I've not got my uh, leveling gear on. Oh, well, I've started now. Not like you don't level up quick enough anyway. I do, on one of my characters, I've got all the light versus dark armor. It gives you, like, extra XP. But I'll be damned if I can remember which one's got it. Oh, they all nasty flesh raiders. Is this a bonus? Yeah, this is the bonus. I'll be with you in a minute, Hollow. I want to get these bonuses. Easy peasy. Do I get a codex for killing you? No. Rude. Mmm, fuck it. Let's do it here. We should be safe. I am. You're not. Clearly. I got this. Uh, yeah. It's cool, man. Just put all the pressure on the new paddle one. What could go wrong? Ooh. Come, Mari. We must do this. Well, I 
I've come to free your students, I'm sorry. You can't help them anymore. Come on, get out of there, you dummy. Learn to use the force so you can open it, you son. You donkey. Do I have to do this before I do this? Or is that going to disappear afterwards? I don't remember how it works. <laughs> I vaguely remember that at least on some occasions, if you finish the main quest, you can't do the... um. Finishes in, finish, but not hand in. You can't um, do the bonus anymore. I don't remember if it's like that for all of them, though. I don't know to recall. Hello. Thank you. Come on, get your ass out of there. Lovely, lovely freedom. Go, man. Alrighty. That's right, you keep up, Barry. Don't you worry. Hello, Mr. Wingmore, don't mind me. No, he's breezy, squeezy lemons. Mm -mm -mm. Here we are. Oi, you're in trouble. Don't be in trouble. I must request that you get yourself out of trouble. Hello. I'm looking for you, you dummy. How rude. <laughs> A bit arrogant. <laughs> You? How? Is he okay? Nah, nah, that's not the Jedi thing. We play in it. No revenge is easy, it's like the easiest thing. Booyah. You knowledge bomb, duh. Alright. Less Raiders. Fierce creatures with an unrelenting hunger. Flesh raiders are believed to be Typhon's only sentient natives. They are at least partially intelligent, capable of building shelters and assembling basic weapons from scavenged technology. But attempts to communicate have all ended violently. Known for devouring their prisoners and any animals they come across, the flesh raiders were formerly content to live in their primitive bone-strewn camps in the hills. Most recently, the expansion of the Jedi and defenseless Twi'lek pilgrims seem to have drawn the Flesh Raiders into the valleys. No one knows where the Flesh Raiders came from. Some speculate they were once a civilized people, driven to cannibalism and madness over years of isolation. Others fear they are the result of the dark side experiments. 
Whatever their origins, the flesh raiders have only grown more powerful and numerous over the years, and they are quickly becoming a blatant iPhone. Don't think we ever get an answer to that, do we? Where they came from. You damn most right you're going on. At a cheek. Don't hurt me, I won't hurt you. Simple. Yep, yep, yep. Hello, I've come to ballet. Do you enjoy my balleting? I got these the wrong way around. <laughs> oh shit. That would explain why I'm struggling. Uh, don't mind me, sir. I'm just looking at my items. Ah, <laughs> uh, where'd it go? Slash. Where is the other? Oh, there we go. Alright, when you there, I knew that. There we go. Oh, yeah. Any loot? Any secret loot? No, I dare you. You had one job to give me a loot. Uh, Oh, do I have any? I do. That's what I use then. Would be rude not to. God, I'm on some real bloody connection issues. Hmm, I all that wind's finally fucking having issues, causing issues. Hmm. It's annoying, it's been fine up until today. How frustrating. Uh, I know I don't need to take you out, but I'm going to do it anyway. I'm letting my anger get the better of me, I'm sorry. This is not the way. I don't think that helps. You're a Jedi, why would you kill me? I'm not going to read those, that's silly. Why would I do that? <laughs> um, what's happening? Yeah. Oh, well. Yeah. Does he know? Nah, that doesn't sound better, could be honest. Sounds a little bit worse, to be honest, actually, thinking about it. A little bit worse. Uh, you, you little lightsaber, how dare you? I just have to beat you with my pogo stick. Oh shit, got all the new eye. I could have spread that out between two fucking levels, couldn't they? <laughs> uh, ch -ch -ch. Sure. That works. Get through late, I already did it all.
Don't thank the force, sir. Thank me. Here's the leader. You don't say. <laughs> Uh, yeah, the force was with me. I'm a special boy. Must use force to bring down rocks. No, oh, so shaky. How rude. Uh, that was amazing. Oh, there, there, Mr. Biff. Uh, yeah, I should stand up. Clearly, everyone else there is fucking useless. Okay, master. Follow the yellow brick road. August Din, a grizzled Jedi master who's fought more battles with the Sith than any other loving member of the Order. Master August Din was an eyewitness to the sacking of Coruscant, the destruction of the Jedi Temple, along with the loss of his Padawan, Bengal Moore, hardened him. Now considered a maverick among his peers, August prefers to leave meditation, debate, and diplomacy to the Jedi Council while he goes out and gets things done. Despite his sometimes abrasive nature, there are many among the Order who respect August as a man of action. Yet even though he would be the first to proclaim that the Jedi need more individuals like himself, August is still haunted by what he's seen, and has refused to take on a new Padawan for many years. Until now. No. You're just a normal boy? No. Not dealing with you if you're a normal boy, sir. You're not special enough, I'm afraid. Is Harry still around? Harry, where'd you go? Well, blue thing says you're still around, but I don't see you. Don't you leave me on this journey. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> I see they still not fixed that, huh? It's one of those bugs, I swear, they fix every now and then, and then it just fucking comes back. Same with the fucking companions getting stuck under the ground. Oh, shit, I ain't. Ready? Beep, beep, beep. Yeah, da, 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 da. Da, oh, wait a minute. Uh, isn't there a codex up here? Memory salves. I would like to for once get everything, everything unlocked. So I don't think I've done that before. It would be nice. Rediscovering Typhon. The birthplace of the Jedi Order was lost for many thousands of years, when known hyperspace lanes leading to the re uh, region collapsed. A fate that has befallen many worlds in the unstable heart of the galaxy known as the Deep Core. After the destruction of the Jedi Temple and Coruscant, Satil Shan embarked on a search to rediscover the lost world. Guided by the Force, she ventured into the Deep Core and re-emerged with Astro... Uh, Astrogen, whatever, <laughs> astrogation charts, <laughs> detailing a new series of stable hyperspace lanes. Typhon was once again connected to the rest of the galaxy. 
Initial exploration of the planet took months, as Jedi scouts combed the surface for clues of Typhon's history. Lives were lost to a troubled landscape, to the flesh raiders, and to forces unknown. But soon the Jedi Council established a new temple on the world, determined to rebuild Typhon and return it to humble glory. Mm -hmm. Seems they've done a pretty banging job of it. Pretty banging indeed. Oh, I do really like this planet. It's very colourful. It only just kind of pops. Hello, oh, fellow Jedi. Don't mind me. Don't shoot at me, you bastard. How rude. I have returned, Master Ren, like, well, next, whatever. Whatever your name is. Uh, yeah, they need help. Oh, it is. It's always with me, sir. Oh, I got all the fear. I don't believe you. Do you still give me skills? I'm wondering how that works if I decided to be a Sith warrior instead as my uh, combat type. And the Jedi are going to train me Sith skills? That'd be interesting. Uh... Yep, oh my tuppy. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Am I supposed to fight somewhere around here? I vaguely remember there being a bonus, maybe? I can't remember if that's in the flashpoint, though. I oh, know, it's in, it's in the real thing. Nice. Oi, would you get... Sir? Oh, God. Um... How dare you ambush me? Only I get to ambush. Oh, I could do without these bloody internet issues. Thank you. I very much appreciate it if you would just work. Oh, well, that's a pretty big one. <laughs> Better than words with talk talk. Yes, yes, I'm level 5 now, it's like it. Oh, I finished. Oh, well. Sorry, you didn't need to die, but, you know, life comes at you slow. Come, Mary. We have a journey to go upon. Oh, look at it. Maybe beautiful temple. Oh, I was really hoping we'd see this in the uh, Mandalorian. Alas, it was not to be. Like, I suppose the ruins of it. Oh, come the f... It... <laughs> I don't think I've ever had it so bad where I don't... I hit like a fucking invisible wall. This is not a game thing, by the way. It's definitely my internet. I I don't know what's wrong with it. <laughs> mm. 
Yeah, yeah, I got I got two classes now. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, it's very exciting. I'm I'm glad of this information that you are giving me. The anticipation is killing me. Hmm. Yeah. Let me, let me add it. I, I, no, sorry, sorry, I forgot you like to build the anticipation before you answer. Now I'll give you a moment whilst I sit here and wait for your answer in anticipation. Oh, how it builds, the anticipation that is, in the wait for your answer. Okay, eventually, Mr. Dentreaty. Den do whatever. You know, you get to a point where the anticipation's built so much that you kinda, you know, kinda just starts falling. Sir. Sir, please. No need you to answer me. Please. Don't do it. I got your name right. Now bless me. Please, Dentary. Dentary. Okay, well, <laughs> fuck me. Why? Why? <laughs> Why you gotta be like this, huh? Huh, here we go. Absolutely. All right, we'll get to it. Why well, you don't have to be so bloody blunt about it, do you? What an asshole! You can have that one. Clearly, you're gunning for it. No? Okay. My generosity knows no bounds, except the one I myself impose upon it, which is quite a few. Come here, come here. Mark one training droid, my asshole. Apparently, I'm still. At risk of pulling fret. <laughs> I'm not sure that's true. We can but hope. Of course, of course, yes. I understand. Hey, Shay Bizler, I didn't know it. How you doing, Shay? You doing in the Jedi? Oh no, not again. <laughs> Don't you be fucking doing that shit again. The Jedi Temple. Since the destruction of the original temple during the sacking of Coruscant, the Jedi Temple on Typhon has become the spiritual home and sanctuary of the Jedi Order. Housing meditation rooms, lecture theatres, and the Jedi archives, the temple's architecture was deliberately changed from the original on Coruscant in line with the Jedi philosophy of non-attachment. The new design is intended to echo the style of Alderaan's famous uh, castles and to evoke the Jedi virtues of humility, serenity, and patience. I feel like those two are in conflict, right? These, these things, and then this, <laughs> right? Oh, we built it to look like a f affluent, very rich, princely castle to show our humility, serenity, and patience. What? <laughs> Construction began a year after the Jedi made a permanent settlement on Typhon and took three years to complete using local Typhonian stone and timber. 
The temple site, built upon the ruins of a much older temple, was chosen by the council after a week of fasting and meditation. While the temple's formidable technological defenses are concealed and integrated into the architecture, it's the presence of the council and the Jedi who train there who truly ensure its safety from invaders. A big red X doesn't bode well, does it? Nope. No, it does not. All right. Terrific. Hmm. Awesome. One second. What? <clears throat> I do not understand why you are being like this. Uh... Oh, it's restarted the stream. Terrific. I hope it hasn't pestered people notifying them. I did not do such a thing. Mm. Keep chugging on, I guess. Well, we will if that works. We'll try again. You know what? Um, I'll take a break. Well, I'll take a break. I'll leave me on. And I'll give you this screen. I'm gonna... I'm gonna try and find where my fucking armor is. <laughs> it's gotta be on someone. Or I've accidentally deleted it. Which would be a problem. Uh, so... Just check it's not an item recovery. I don't know if it would be there if I did delete it. Like... Hmm. The character I was leveling up, I did delete and didn't check what they were wearing. <laughs> that is, it's possible that I have goofed. And by possible, I mean likely. This boy's level one, maybe it's him. Although he seems to be wearing normal armor, so that indicates no. No. Oh. Uh, that would be a night. No, 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 no. Okay. Hmm. I should have two sets of it. Why it's not just in the fucking collections menu? You can't just get it from there. I do not know. Like, that would solve many issues. I don't really see an issue with you being able to have multiple versions of it. It's not like you can trade it to people. Uh, it's not my legacy thing, is it? It should be. That should be where I put it. But that thing's so full. In fact... Yeah, you can see how full it is. <laughs> Look at this. Uh, God, where would I even have put it? Uh, I think it sticks out like a sort of um. So the fact that I can't see it there says a lot. Uh, no, <laughs> I'm gonna say no. No, it's not in there. Hmm. I'm pretty sure it's all yellowy. Uh, where's my normal house? This is not. Got it looks different on here. Uh, no. Alright. Can you the other screen back? Not that one. Can confirm we are not on our way. We're already here. Well, some fucking what? Well, it's not be on you. Your max level. You two have not been used. Hmm. The word shit comes to mind. 
I think I've done a bobo. I don't think there's any way to get your characters back either, is there? I know in WoW, if you uh, delete a character, you get, there's like a separate menu you can go to get, to get it back. But it's over like level 20. There's some how that is not WoW. It's not. It's not in the collections. Is it? They haven't done a solid and put it in there. I'm gonna assume or not. Outlook not so good. Uh... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> nah. Expecting too much. Or too little. Probably too much. Hmm. You maybe? Maybe, maybe I've got it on you. Do -do, do -do, do -do. Yeah, da 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 da. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Sheet. Hmm. That's the problem with having so many fucking characters. <laughs> Can't remember what fucking item I've left on which person. I don't think it would be on any of those. So, I'll just write a ticket. I'll write a ticket and then we'll kind of carry on. Not like I need it. You level up quick enough anyway. It's nice to have. It's nice just not to have to fucking worry about... Oh, I suppose you have to change your mods on it, don't you? So it's not like you don't have to worry about anything. Uh, customer service... Be with you in a moment. Alrighty. Now we continue. And pray for no more disruptions. <laughs> Hello, Master.
Satil Shyam. Grand Master of the Jedi Order and leader of the Jedi Council, Satil Shan was born in the core world of Brentel Fuhr and is descended from legendary Jedi Bastila Shan. Both a gifted warrior and wise teacher, Satil was personally responsible for rediscovering Typhon and its hyperspace route. Ever since she was dev as devoted herself to the Jedi resettlement of Typhon and revitalization of the Order, Satil has played a key role in recent galactic history in other ways as well. She fought on the front lines of several major battles, including the Battle of Alderaan and Ren Var, and was present as a Padawan during the Imperial retaking of Korriban, the first modern contact between the Sith Empire and the Republic. She is greatly respected by certain members of the Republic military, and her advice is sought by the C Supreme Chancellor. In person, Satil's uh, strength in the Force is matched with a keen intelligence and subtle sense of humor. I don't know that I see much of this sense of humor. Subtle indeed. Return to me, Ari. Return to me. I've missed you and your little chirps. Less so you're stamping on the ground when I'm stood still, I'm gonna be honest with you. But hey, I take the good with the bad, so I'll take the good with the bad. Hello, master. Um. Yeah, yeah, that was me. No, 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 no. Shaking but solid. Damn it, why are you doing <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> Why is it doing that? I don't want the big fucking notification that you I turn that off. I can't get a win today. Thank you, Master. I thought there was an actual lightsaber then. I was like, well, that kind of fucks the story a little bit, doesn't it? <laughs> and you too, Master. And you too. Alright, Zookat. Now to this run. I'm on a journey of journeys to become a master of force and stuff yeah yeah i suppose i should have a look around the uh, temple actually i'm trying to get all the codexes there's bound to be some lying around in rooms i very clearly remember like a bunch hiding in the uh dark temple on Korriban. Especially the, uh, the data grunts. What are you, you, yeah, what are you doing here? Oh, never mind. It's too good to be true that there would be no more issues. Alright. <sighs> suppose it was going too well. Alright. Internet's been fine all oh, bloody day. What is going on here? Are you a Sif? Oh, good damn it. Camera, play ball. Play ball. I obviously want to see what's in this fucking thing. Oh, fuck you. I think it's a Sif. I guess they're trying to purify him. Well, never know. Just a fucking camera. That's a little background detail there. Oh, here we go.
Rebuilding the Jedi Order In the aftermath of the sacking of Coruscant and the establishment of peace with the Empire, the fate of the Jedi Order was uncertain. With their temple looted and in ruins, and relations with the Republic government at an all-time low, the Jedi left the Republic capital to establish a new temple on the rediscovered world of Typhon, the homeworld of the first Jedi. By returning to their ancestral home, the Jedi hoped to reconnect with the beliefs and ideals of those who founded the Order 20 millennia ago. They sought to reclaim forgotten knowledge and wisdom left behind by ancient masters, scouring the planet for holocrons and Jedi artifacts to replace those that had been lost during the destruction of the Temple of Coruscant. They began training a new generation of students and began to mend relations with those who blamed the Jedi for the destruction of the war. On Typhon, many young Jedi began uh, believed they have to rediscover the original purpose of their order, to stand firm against the servants of the dark side, removed from the machinations and concessions of pol politicians and bureaucrats. The Jedi have once again become beacons in the internal struggle between light and dark. Lovely jabbly, you teach her. We teach me. We teach me the ways of the ways. No. Most guys is not even listening. You teach them though, won't you, jerk? Man, I never look. I never just explore this game. I should. It's cool. Oh, so... For some reason I assumed both sides were connected. Interesting. Interesting. I thought it went round in like a circle. Not two semicircles. The more you know. This guy's just showing off. He's not even teaching. Just showing off. What a jerk. This one's a long, long separate little teaching going on here. She's thinking. Well, she pretended to think, but she's not really listening. We've all been there. I've been barred from this room. Naked surf on Christ. <laughs> Jesus, <all right. laughs> I don't want to know what you're up to, sir. Alrighty. I always love this big thing in the middle. Ooh, a piece of codex. The Jedi Council. Those who walk the path of the Jedi are guided and overseen by the High Jedi Council, sworn to protect and defend the Republic. The Council has existed in one form or another for millennia, comprised of the wisest Jedi Masters of every era. After the destruction of the Jedi Temple and the signing of the Treaty of Coruscant, the modern council removed itself from the politics of the galactic capital and settled on Typhon. The ancestral home of the Jedi, led by Master Satil Shan, the council now struggles to uphold its peaceful ideals in the face of the Sith threat. This paradox is reflected in the personalities and beliefs of various members of the council, some such as the scholarly Master Sayo Bakan, hope the Sith can be redeemed and returned to, li to the light side. Others, such as the militaristic Master Jarek Gaiden, uh, believe peace can only be achieved when all those who serve the dark side are destroyed. How dark side, Helen? Don't you... Oh, you bastard. You bastard. <laughs> I don't want that on my screen, Xbox. What is wrong with you? Let me get some cool screenshots. So rude. There is darkness here. Yeah. Well, hello, Kira. Keldor. I always love a good Keldor. Would love to play a Keldor, but you know.
Yeah, they didn't change overnight. That was me. No, wait, is that me? I mean, I know that's me, but still. <laughs> I'm not supposed to. Yeah, me neither. It's too late, it's already happened. Deal with it. Oh, I refuse. Oh, wait, no, I'm, I'm good. I'll do it. Fuck you, Xbox. Ooh, the music. Ooh. One second. Fangasm to the music with me. Alright, if I do that, work with me here, then I do this, yes, it's gone, okay. Progress, progress, actual fucking progress, I cannot believe it either. I can't help but notice I've not been told to go to a trainer yet, which tells me that they don't have much use anymore, I guess. Are you not going to teach me anything? I'm, I'm going to... Assume they still give you vehicle skills and stuff like that. But that's their only purpose now. Because it doesn't make sense that they would give you Sif skills, right? If you chose to go Sif. I didn't even have a look in that, did I? <laughs> I went and did that and then fucked off. Is there anything to click on in here? I must know. This was the Sif temple. One of these would be clickable. Just saying. Just throwing that out there, you know? I'm saying they've got it better, but I think we all know if they do. I think we all know it to be true. Hello. What's going on in here? No normal inspection, are we? It's just the general training ground. You are fucked, mate. You're fucked. Wee. Very cool. I don't think I've ever been in this room. <laughs> this is why we must explore, you know. Find that which we have not found before. Mm. You guys have to have a little meditation. A little group meditation, I understand. Hello, Mr. S yeah, I'm doing great, thank you. Thank you. Actually, I'm a little explore right now, it turns out. Good timing. You should be real proud of yourself. And is this the heroic? We don't need that yet. Anything else going on in here? This is how we leave. I remember that. Hello, chat. Some little Astro Max game worked on. Very cute. Very cute, very cute. Bada bam, bada bam. Do a jump. Bada bam, bada bam. Oh, I'm coming, Master August. Don't you worry. Are you? Are you? Are you not alone? And I wish they'd give a red skin option for the Nautilons. Is that too much to ask? I think not. I like to misunderstand. Wow, 
Why me? Well, I'm glad you did, mister. Nah, nah, I ain't teaching you shit. Alrighty. Yeah, I want it. I want it like a speeder bonnet. Force is always with me. What do you mean? Gotta be honest with you, Master. Not gonna use those. Probably not gonna use them. What even are they? <laughs> yeah, they. I see Graydon thinking, like, you'll be fucking level 10 anyway. We're giving them to me for now. <laughs> Master, I don't know if you realize this, but I'm not level 10. I got a ways to go. Do you look good for an all alone? <laughs> you look alright. <laughs> uh, the not alone's are so close to looking great, but the faces just aren't quite there. Sad times. Hello, fellow Jedi. What are we doing today? Are we doing sticks? Cool. I'll leave you to it then. Whee! What is down there? Oh, it's just one of those things. I mean... Oh, yeah, yeah, that's a view, boys. That's a view. Yep, yep, yep. I see what you see. Can you see what I see? Yup. Are we going the right way? I think so. Hey, buddy. Hey, Uxie Beast. I went right through you. How do you feel about that? Please work. No. No, they do not. Good to know. Give me a codex. I demand a codex. Oh, dare you. Dare you not give me a codex. So disrespectful. Hey, I think I found the Twi'leks. Who are you looking for? I'm here. You see? You see me? Yep. No, no, you still look. I'm here. I'm here. Oh. K Caligori Village. Named after an old Twi'lek word for beginning. Caligori Village is a settlement in the Typhonian Hills. Founded by a group of Twi'lek pilgrims. Fleeing persecution. The pilgrims asked the Republic for permission to settle on Typhon, but were refused. Defying the rule, uh, ruling, the pilgrims founded a small camp that gradually grew into Galakori village. The village matriarch's home is built on the site of the original landing. Galakori is technically an illegal settlement, without protection under Republic law. As the village grew, boasting fertile fields and its own irrigation system, the Twi'lek pilgrims realized they were expanding into Flesh Raider territory and have been fighting other creatures ever since without outside help. Despite the anger of the villagers at the Jedi who have abandoned them, many Padawans travel to Galakori village to seek out the Matriarch's Maker uh, blessing or to learn about the pilgrims' teachings. I can do that, I'm here. 
Hello, bow down to me, I am a Jedi. You must bow down to me because you are not a Jedi. That is the rules. Yep, 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 yep. Hello, do you wish to bow down to me? That doesn't sound like you do. That's not very compassionate, is it? Mm hmm. Hmm. I don't feel like just readily agreeing to this is a good idea. <laughs> like finding them, sure. Like killing the raiders, mm, less so. Although we have already done a lot of that, I guess, so sure. Eh, speed isn't in my nature. Yep, yep, that's the big giveaway to him being dead. I understand. I've done this shit before, sir. You're not very grateful, are you? Very rude. Tut-tut. Tut-tut, sir. Um, hmm. All right. All right, get on your ass. Twi'lek. Twi'leks are a humanoid species with long prehensile head tails called lecu -orga uh, organs housing sections at the Twi'lek brain and specialize for communication through subtle motion. Twi'leks are native to the harsh world of Ryloth. A planet that has suffered from occupation by the Hutt Cartel in recent years. Twi'leks and Ryloth, not forced to work in the mines, are often taken as slaves. Exported to markets throughout the Outer Rim. I guess this shit just keeps happening to them every fucking generation, huh? Bless them. Millennia of dispersion into the wider galaxy, however, means that many Twi'leks have little or no sense of connection with their beleaguered homeworld. Twi'leks may be second only to humans in their ubiquity throughout known space. Nonetheless, many Twi'leks can't escape the shadows of slavery and the underworld often. They find work with the same pirates, slavers, and spice dealers who have traditionally oppressed their species. Twi'lek names vary dramatically, depending on whether the parents follow the old Twi'lek tradition of combining given and family name, or use the more common approach, separating first name and surname, used by many other species. Some Twi'leks eschew any surname altogether. Oh. Go you, Twi'leks. Hello, sir. Vendors, how are you doing? Ooh, side quest. I'm on it. Well, I don't know that they will. How was their story anyway, my lady? Mm -hmm. Cheeky. Hmm. That doesn't sound very primitive. Mm. Go on then, I'm on it. Only because she has nicely, though. Shut sure in, chicken wing. Hello, 
Da kommt der Bargen. Well, she's right there. Alright, I need to be so rude. Wow, I mean, you didn't have to come here, did you? Yep. Yeah, what's wrong? Now I'm on it. Bit rude. You yeah, but I'm a good boy, you understand? I must do good boy things. Oh, so that sounds smarter. <laughs> Let's be real, that sounds smarter. Although, how am I supposed to bring it all there on my own? Another question. Of course, uh, Mistress uh, Palven, Rana. Nah, Morant. Not gonna be doing that, thank you. Uh, do a jump. There we go. That was definitely a jump. Yep, yep. Hello. Nah, me neither. Don't worry about it. Yeah. Lovely little farm. That looks less lovely, but hey. A little bit of poison, never hurt nobody. Are you okay? You look, you look like you're dying. That's never good. Don't want to die. Traditional Jedi gal. I like it. You're a bit creepy. No, no, I ain't got a clue what's going on. Lovely. All right, buddy. That sounds like a lot of work, huh? Oh, go on then, let me brand. Cool. Can't be having that. I lie to you. We're all open things. Yep, 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 yep. 
definitely, and most especially, things. It's with the spooky music. Are you gonna creep on me? Can't puff on me if I puff find you. I oh, didn't see that coming, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, well. <laughs> Effective. That's what that was. Who are you? Just standing there unharmed. Come here, mangler. It's a mangled anymore. Easy peasy. Alright, we need one more for the bonus. Lovely javelin. Hello. I've come to get a bonus from you. Thank you. How kind. Okay, game is cool. I'm not in combat anymore. I promise. Okay, never mind. I take it back. I take back all promises. Uh, I guess I should put this on. So I do not have gear. Did a big old goof. Peasy squeezy. Easy lemons. Yeah. Easiest of lemons. Madabam, mm -mm -mm. madabam. Lighting you with my torch, with my torch. You're ignited. That is cool. Badabam, badabam. For you. Oh. Well, hello there, Mr. Elite. Just how elite are you? Not very elite, it turns out. Yeah, yeah. It's fine with me. <clears throat> fuck's sake. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> the first one you know, distracted me. That's my excuse. It's a good excuse. Don't don't pretend that it's not. Uh, I like Kalovish. Oh, Jerry, thank you. Mm. So the rest of the tweet like said, we don't don't want to follow you just because you said we should, and you took issue with that, huh? Yeah. Interesting. Uh, we're a nice boy. We'll be a nice boy. Oh yeah, I noticed. Uh... Difficult why?
Oh, believe me, I will. Stop leveling up, Nemi, how dare you? So rude. Twi'lek Pilgrims. Typhon is home to a small settlement of Twi'lek Pilgrims united by their belief in a humble lifestyle and the authority of their matriarchs. Although their numbers are few, the Pilgrim movement goes back almost two decades, and until their recent arrival in Typhon, they had never possessed a permanent home, nor escaped persecution. The founding pilgrim matriarch gained her followers while serving at the refugee camp at settlement catering to escapees from Ryloth, the enslaved Twi'lek homeworld. The refugees listened to the matriarch's stories about a set of ancient texts she had discovered in an alien world, which urged sim uh, simplicity, devotion to family and faith in a spiritual mother. But while some Twi'leks gladly joined the matriarch, others saw her as a cult leader taking advantage of the desperate. The pilgrims left the settlement and travelled to one Twi'lek settlement after another, gaining in numbers but always driven off. Fleeing into hyperspace after years of wandering, the pilgrims at last arrived on Typhon. The Jedi only recently arrived themselves, were astonished that pilgrims could st uh, stumble upon the secret Jedi homeworld so easily. The Matrix saw the Pilgrims' discovery of an inhabitable planet as destiny. Since then, the Pilgrims have done everything possible to make a permanent home of Typhon, building their community and creating new traditions. Whether the movement will survive in the face of the flesh raided danger is an open question. Very nice, very nice. I feel like they could be spreading these abilities out a bit more. Hmm, that's the Abella Air Force missing <laughs> on uh, my Sentinel, Marauder, whatever. I suppose he's a Sentinel now, isn't he? Switched him up. <laughs> Ooth. <laughs> Do not get stuck. It is not the way. I promise you this. Where's my boy? There's my boy. Hello, fellow Jedi. How you doing? How's life treating you? I did it. Are you proud of me? Thank you. Thank you. I know I have. Yeah, look at you up there, you sneaky bastards. I wonder where that goes. Don't think you do. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. Hmm. Yeah. Do you though? Do you? Why? Oh, well, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll change them, but let's just ignore that bit, shall we? Uh, let's just move on from that bit and pretend I didn't say that. Nah. As opposed to an old man. My choice is so varied. <laughs> well, you go fucking do it then, mate. Good. i go up this way. I'm intrigued. Alright. Oh, Dead flesh radar, I guess this is where they've been attacking from. And another attack is imminent. I'll not allow it. Not in my kingdom. Oh wait, I don't think this is my kingdom. I don't think I own this place at all. Hmm. 
Booyah. No, so it just takes you down here, huh? That's interesting. I never knew this little area existed, though. That's cool. The more you know. The more you wish you didn't. Alright. Apparently two of them did not count as flesh raiders, it would seem. Weird. How peculiar. Come to Papa. No, come to do it. Do a jump. Oh, I don't have it. It's so cool down. You can have that. You can have that. Oi! But you know what's at me, shit. <laughs> I dare you. Do you contribute? Hello. Uh, see ya. I found your gold thing. It was a Christmas miracle. And it's not even life day. Any more flesh raiders for any more? Come to Papa, I still need five of you. I don't know how. Oh, hello, blood skin. Ow, that was fucking rude. Ow, that's also fucking rude. What the hell? Get some respect. I appear to be taking a lot of hits. Oh god, I'm hurting. Help me. Oh, fucking Jesus. <laughs> Guess you better get rid of them, huh? Don't make me bring out a companion, you son of a gun. I'll do it. Well, I'd have to go to a fucking thing first, but I'll do it. Oh, fuck it out. Do it. Do it. Do it. Fuck him up. Screw him up. Yes, get wrecked. Screw you, bullet boy. No, no, your shit. He apparently was not a flesh raider. So saith the bonus quest. What am I looking for now? Oh, these are different. Oh, whatever. <laughs> They're all fucking flesh raiders. What difference does it make? This is not a specific flesh raider that we asked for. Hmm. What do I care? Hello. Excuse me. I must destroy your elixir. It is the way of the me. Are there any elixirs up here? I don't see no elixirs. I see a chest. But it have been taken by one more deserving than I. Hello, I don't suppose you have an elixir anywhere, do you? No, no, okay. No, I just thought I'd ask. You know how it is. Didn't realize I should be looking for them out there. That has poo pooed my plans. Sorry that you all had to die for the cause. Don't come in this cave, this is my cave. Yeah, things in here that must be clicked upon shall be clicked upon by me and me alone. For I am the selfish man. I'm assuming these little red pools are where they were. Yep, okay, one's just spawned there. Don't. It's still my stuff. No, it's still my stuff. It's my stuff. I claim it for me and me alone. Yes, yes, the selfishness flow through you. <laughs> oh, well, I... <gasps> 
Ooh, a piece of candy. <gasps> Ooh, another piece of candy. <laughs> Where are these bastards? I feel like I've taken out my fair share of bloody flesh raiders at this point. Ah, oh, you stunned me, you prick. What are you doing? Do I need to take you out? I'm gonna help my friend who I do not know. Okay, I don't need to help my friend who I do not know. <laughs> Turns out they don't need me. And I don't need them. It's fine. I can go solo. Right? Maybe? Hello, are you my bonus? You are my bonus, thank you. It was so much simpler than I realized. Get the man his bonus. Give the man his bonus, get zetted upon. Connection issues always make me sad I think that they make things real bad Connection issues always make me sad Always make things so very bad And then you get a big X on your connection spot And you realize you're about to get kicked out of the game Ain't that a shame Ain't that a shame? Ain't that a mother, 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 mother fucking shame? Pretty fucking random. We had like an hour of it working, but now it said fuck you. I'm really dead. I don't want to die. I don't think. to live okay well, this is this is this is happening it's definitely happening can't deny that fact oh I've come to fight Thank you. I'll take your gold thing. No, no, I said I will take your gold thing. Excuse me, sir. You do not seem to understand that I want your gold thing. And um, once again, we got a fucking X up in the right hand corner, and it make me sad. It make me sad. Boy, oh boy, it make me sad. I'm gonna destroy you. I hope you don't mind. But you are not allowed to exist. This cache contains weapons and technology the flesh raiders used to raid and hunt the Twi'leks. Oh no, I'm keeping you. Take it for the villagers. Hello, buddy. T7 equals glad to see Jedi. T7 equals captured by flesh raider plus need rescuing. <laughs> what? Consider yourself rescued, buddy. T Jedi equals T seven's hero. T seven equals Jedi Alright, <laughs> <laughs> uh, restraining ball forty detect. I'm glad you're in one piece, buddy. Similar like deactivation, new spike ammo recorded flesh radar allies. Oh. <laughs> My little droids in this can see. <laughs> He's not supposed to be, but he is, bless him. He just made it ten times better. <gasps> you saw Jedi equals take T7 to safety and remove restraining bolt. Of course I'll remove it, buddy. Training ball equals removed. T7 equals scanning range and shit. T7 equals ready to roll. 
I just, but uh, a lot of connection issues today, so if the stream's really laggy or whatever, I can but apologize. I can't do nothing. It's been a jerk. I love having you with me, T7, but I ain't walking all the way through that shit again. <laughs> I'm teleporting back, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm going to make an attempt to teleport back. The game may not have my back on this one. Hello, sir. I've returned. Found your dead father. He's dead. I told you. Ah, uh, yeah. I'd like the rest. Oh, there's some bones, too. Should I have brought the bones? No! I'm a good boy. Well, no, but... You mean, you know... I didn't do it for you. Uh, yeah, fuck you. Well, just because you say it don't mean it's true. Jerk face. You have the face of a jerk. Well, I don't care what you prefer. Face of a jerk. I said it, I meant it, I will say it again. It's a jerk of a face. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna rat out your captain. My dirty snake. Give him a slap, he called you old. I mean, you are old, but he's old too, so it's rude. What the fuck do you mean? What is happening? What was that? What happened to me? Who's scanning me? Who who scanned me? T7, did you scan me? I don't know if I want you near me if you're going to start scanning me. It's an invasion of my fucking privacy, sir. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, it's true, you could always leave. Not much, I promise you. I can't. I need to learn my lessons, I'm sorry. Well, that seems pessimistic. Somebody goes, so who's Master August? What kind of robot he was ready? I found this droid, he's pretty cool, but he's got no sense of private shit. Learn boundaries, T7. Learn boundaries. T7 plus Jedi, uh, uh, prison breakout equals exciting. I agree, T7. It was an exciting teleport. Sure thing, buddy. I mean, master. Talk to me. Talk to me, Morint. Morint. Use your lips to speak. Verbalize the words within your mind. 
You got two fucking Lucko, use one of them. I hate you. It's my honor to serve. We can, we're going to do it the other way around. All right. I'll play ball. All right. But what if I give him a slap? Let me give him a good old slap. Ooh, I did a level. Did you do a level, Rana? No, you didn't. Oh god, earthquake. No, oh, no, you fucking talk. You suck ass. You understand that? You're a jerk. You're a big old jerk. Nobody likes you. What a jerk. Come, Mari. What is doing that? Has that always happened? What the fuck? What's happening? The world is falling apart. Hold me, Ari. Jesus. Has this always been a thing? The rocks are falling from the sky. Oh, hello. Uh, I'm screwed. Let's leave this place. It's too scary. And <laughs> Uh, this way. This way, yeah. Baby, baby. What, 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 baby, Ah, oh, lovely water fight. You love to see it. Any more quests here? Has this boy got another quest for me over here? I can't but assume he would. Seems like it's time. Yeah, it's time. Hello, I've come to take your quest to destroy a droid. Oh, what the fuck is happening? The meat didn't What's happening? But the earthquakes. What is going on? They're just falling from the fucking sky randomly. Is this supposed to happen or is this a bug? Excuse me, would you load in so I can hit you? Could you load in please? Oh, we're having a connection issue. How quaint. I'm jumping, I'm jumping, I'm jumping. How dare you hit me while I'm not functioning. So inconsiderate. Do a loot. There we go. Always do a loot. Even if you don't wanna always remember you. Gotta do a loot. Gotta do a loot. Yeah. 
Thank you. Not got anything else from here. Alright. Alright, fair enough. I understand. Jump. Nah, I'm running for your practice era. What do you think about that? But I can help you. Hello. I don't know you. Sounds a bit weird. Only just got here. Ooh la la, Miss Ami. I never know how to do this quest. Because the light side thing is to turn them in. But I know my uh, my character's going to be in a relationship himself at some point. So it always seems very hypocritical. <laughs> I guess, I guess he learns, right? He learns that this is not the way. And that romance is not necessarily bad. Uh, so romance is bad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this seems a bit dodgy. Meow. Oh boy. I'm sure they will be, sir. Yep, 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 that's how that works. Jump! Hello. I'm pretty good at true. Hmm, you're a beginner? Uh, scary looking. And then it just pours out. Kaldor's a badass. They're awesome, I tell you. Sure thing. Consider it handled. Thank you, thank you. If I could be a Kaldor, I would be so happy. But I can't, so I'm forever sad. Tis my destiny. Hey there, Exibus, give me your cat. Oh, ya ba do ba da ba ba do ba. 
Hello. Goodbye. And this greedy asshole with two lightsaber sticks. When one stick is not enough, you must have two. Leave him alone. He's my friend. No, leave him alone. I don't know him, but he's the bestest friend I've ever had. Hello. Hi. Buy my shit. Okay, repair my shit. No, you don't need to buy it. No, you do need to buy it. Buy it. Buy my shit. Uh, should I? Yeah, let's do it. We're not doing it yet, but we'll pick it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I was going to say. Oh, are you? Ooh la la. Alrighty, uh, I'd like to assist you, sir, in touching the temptation that is. Yeah. All right, I'm on it, buddy. I'm on it. I got this. Sounds Gucci to Michi. Oh boy, will I. My favorite species. Padawan to August Din, your master speaks highly of your potential. Do you know someone named Fear? Poor girl, no doubt apologizing again. She nearly shot me when I broached her on Rex's Prime. Forget how violently some humans react when first meeting with my species. I don't understand why they always sh seem to shoot before thinking. That's humans for you. Uh, at least you weren't hurt. Luckily, Fia's aim was unbalanced by a fear. It's kind of you to deliver this olig recording, though I should gently instruct Padawan Fia to stop interrupting my work, speaking of which. Here, examine this droid's cognitive unit I recovered from the ruins 20,000 years old, yet still functional. Our forebears built things to last. That's amazing. A shame the cognitive unit's owner had to be destroyed. It was a magnificent machine, but quite hostile. The ruins of Lower Kalef are filled with droids constructed during Typhon's original colonization by the galaxy's first force users. We don't know the Typhonian droid's purpose, only that they attack anyone who enters the ruins. My mission is to learn why. Has anyone been hurt? We've had a few, several serious injuries left unchecked. The droids are going to kill someone. We can't let it come to that. It's been millennia since the Typhonian droids were memory wiped. Their programming lies buried amid trillions of accumulated data bits. Another good data bit. I've constructed a scanner to analyze the droid's cognitive units for command protocols, but I need several samplings to sort through the static. I got it, buddy. I'm on it. Good. This will be greatly accelerate my uh, efforts to solve this mystery and make the ruins safe. Take the scanner when you encounter Typhonian droids in Lower Kalef. Disable them and scan the remains.
Bring the scanner back to me when its memory is full so that I can analyze the data. Good luck. Thank you, buddy. Uh, use the scanner on any Typhonian droids you encounter and still don't ruin that. <laughs> Bastards. How dare you promote your guild. It's nice, it tells you when it resets. How considerate. The ruins of Kalef. Crumbling walls and rubble are all that remain of the fortified city of Kalef. Carvings at Kalef suggest this site has been inhabited and abandoned more than once over the millennia, but always by force users. This has given rise to dozens of theories about Kalef from scholars at the Jedi Temple, not to mention interest from archaeologists seeking artifacts of the ancient Jedi. Unfortunately, exploration of Kalef is hampered by ancient hostile droids that still roam the ruins. The presence of these droids, the discovery of surviving computers, and reports of strange lights at night prove Kalef still has sections with functioning power, despite being abandoned for centuries. Because of this, some members of the first expedition to Typhon recommend restoring Kalef and making it the new settlement of the Jedi Order. The Council decided against this, however, preferring to study Kalef and its history from a distance. Lovely jubbly. Bubbly bubbly. Hello, you've been sinning. Have you heard of the good book of the Jedi Order? I know you're up to Spaniards, don't you talk about random shit. I'm next. Discomfort. All these answers suck. <laughs> They're all bad. Well, don't mind me. I'm a nosy posy. You're in love. <laughs> Relax, it's gonna be fine. I mean, you can have teamwork without love. Just throwing that out there. I do not presume to know. An upstart? How dare you? Well, that's not much of a sacrifice, is it? You should be ashamed of yourself, sir. <laughs> what a line. Do what you will, do not do what you want. You know, you're making it very hard for me not to do so. I was kind of like tempted to just not do it anyway. But you are a jerk. I can't say I'm overly fond of jerks. Go on, get them before they despawn. Get them before they despawn. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. I believe in you. No! They despawned. Come here. I must get you before the other despawns. Okay, loot and then get. 
Get it before it disappoints. Jesus Christ. You can do it. You can do it. I believe in you, Zucat. Come on. Come on, Zucat. You can do it. You can do it. Yes. Two is probably all we're going to get, so I'm not going to bother with the other one. Get out of here. Quickly. Quickly now. Haste is a must. Before the despawnation begins. You can do it. Yes, you got me. Yes. Very good, very good. Excuse me, I need you for the bonus. You do not understand. The bonus. You're not a bonus. What the hell? Hello, have you come to see my bonus? Bonus. Bonus, baby, bone, bone. You see that? I'm not done now, you simple bitch. Never again will you come to me. Oh, I missed the thing, didn't I? Can't have that. Uh, yeah, yeah, Typhonium Wardroid. The ruins of Kalef are overrun with various squads of ancient and hostile war droids, a deadly remnant of Typhon's mysterious past. The original purpose of the droids has been lost in the mist of time. Some speculate they were once guardians, programmed to protect and powerful secrets of Typhon's original Jedi inhabitants. Others believe the droids were used for combat training by the Order shortly after the creation of the first proto-lightsaber. A more sinister theory suggests that the droids were somehow involved in the destruction of Caliph itself. Whatever the explanation, one fact is not in dispute. The droids will attack any living creature that dares to enter the territory. They still fiercely patrol. Lovely jabbly. Hello, Mr. Side Quest. I'm gonna click on you. As you check over the Flesh Raider's corpse, you notice movement from inside his backpack. A helpless flesh rooted baby falls out of the backpack. It isn't aggressive and will obviously die if you don't miss the The Jedi Temple has been noted to take in the orphaned animals. Perhaps he would maintain it. The baby is obviously starved and won't survive the trip without the food. Be great. <laughs> I cannot speak so quick. This is an issue I have. How dare you? Uh, Geet. Geed, have you heard about my geed? Geed are hoofed quadrupeds indigenous to Typhon, notable for their muscular forelegs and the distinctive tufts of hair on their shoulders, back and chin. They're typically encountered grazing alone or in the small herds. Geed are not particularly aggressive, but are threatened. They're capable of causing injury or even death with their massive forelegs and powerful jaws. Attempts to domesticate Gid have proved unsuccessful due to their stubborn and occasionally irritable nature. Jedi Master Silvate has taken to labeling Padawans with a particularly lumbering lightsaber stance as devotees of the form of the Gid. At least one of these Padawans, since proclaimed a full Jedi Knight, has taken this mild insult to heart, developing several lightsaber techniques inspired by study and observation of these strange uh, creatures. Master Silvate considers this a mark of his success as a teacher. But he does. Son of a bitch. What the fuck are you? Ooh, taunt. I am not a taunty boy yet. Yeah? Resolute. Alright. I'll put you on a key bind for when I, uh, you know what, this is not, because there's loads out, load, loadouts now. Oh, there's no point not to have it on there, though. You might need it at some point. Excuse me, I've, inside the backpack, the Flash Raider baby tears through kid meat. It seems to gain some measure of strength. It may now be able to survive a trip to the Jedi Temple and must equip. Yay. Yay. Also, yay. Oh, oh, 
Da, we stop it again. With some pauses going. The internet wants to break free. I'm not allowed it, internet. You will continue for fuck's sake. You have been given this purpose. Utilize it. Get out of here. Hmm. How are you doing, despair? How's life treating you? Alright, yeah, that's you dealt with. Come here, you. Your turn. Your turn has come. Your turn has come to be destroyed by my lightsaber that I have deployed. I am a ye die. Well done. You can speak. Don't go to ye die. Very different. Why were you playing at? Don't throw me around, that's rude. No, Jedi, not ye die. Sir, please. Ooh. That's what you get for calling me a ye die. Look who's talking, did you hear him, Gary? Call me a ye die. Do I look like a ye die to you? No, ye die. I'm good. I try. No, I try. Uh, big stress because of online school problems. Are you still having issues with your uh, logging in and stuff? I'm okay, thank you. Tut tut. Mm. Uh, hmm. But why? Yeah. Lovely. Good plan, Master Kiwix. And with you, Master. You're a month behind. Um, have they uh, said anything helpful? Is it making any progress? Holocron. Holographic chronicles, more commonly called holocrons, a sophisticated data storage device is capable of cataloging vast amounts of complex information within their crystal lattice structure, frequently used by both Jedi and Sith to preserve the wisdom of ancient masters and Sith lords. Holocrons can only be accessed by force-sensitive individuals. Some are merely repositories of incredible lore while others possess virtual personalities of their own, modelled after their creators. Many believe it was actually the Sith who first developed the holocron technology, as the oldest known examples are all relics of the dark side. Interestingly, Jedi holocrons take the form of a glowing cube, while Sith holocrons are usually pyramid-shaped. Some scholars claim the six-sided cube of the Jedi represents a more modern and advanced version of the original four- and five-sided pyramid favoured by the Sith. Though hard evidence for this idea is scarce. Interesting. Very interesting. Oh, let me up. There we go. <laughs> you thought I was going to fight you, didn't you? I ain't fighting shit. 
Whoa, buddy. Got that, my Ari. <laughs> Scared the shit out of me, boy. What are you doing? Hmm? What are you doing? Oh, I love you. I can't stay angry at you. My mind says grr, but my my heart says oh. This is the way. Do a jump, do a jump, baby. Where is this? Where is this, baby? Boy, we. Connection issues, you know I love you. Connection issues, that's why I say fuck you. Get the hell out of my game. God damn it. Let me move. Let me move. My kingdom to move. Oh, don't cross me. I don't want the X. No, don't do you see me. I need to live. I need to live. Please. There's so little to live for. Let me live for it. Oh, why? Why you gotta break my internet? Why you gotta break my internet? Why you gotta break my internet? Thank you. Thank you, I'll take that. Don't you growl at me. With your robotic voices, I suppose. Hmm. Hello, I have come to bargain. That was a lie, there will be no bargaining. It's your fault for believing the lie. Yump. Yump with me, yump with me, yump do do do. Oh, I like to yump all over you. Ah, uh, he, uh, yes. Now you gotta go in, August. You gotta go in, because we gotta go inside the dock. Can't be out. The poor man, he's deluded. Uh, do I want to do that? There's, that's maybe the wrong place to go. I want to go here. If only I used my head. If only I use my head. Do I have the ability to drive? Yeah. No. So I probably do have to go to the skill guy. Hello. My scanner's memory is already full. Project perfect timing. I'll collect your data with my own readings and analyze them together. My skin game that was that took longer. Hmm. It seems the droids were indeed built for war. Twenty thousand years later, they still pursue their primary function. How sad. Three ancient droids were soldiers in Typhon's Great Force Wars, a time before there were Jedi, Sith, or even a Republic. Quite a revelation. According to the droids' logs, Calef was a stronghold of the Dark Side's forces. They made their last stand there. As they died, the Dark Siders activated the droids as a doomsday weapon, hoping to ensure the Light Side's destruction as well. You have a plan for him? The council must deliberate and decide what should be done about the droids. It's, it isn't up to us. By your efforts, we see Kalef is now fresh light. I will commend you to the council. Oh, thanks, man. I delayed you enough. I know you have important work you and August do. Give him the, uh, my best. <laughs> Oops, the day is here. You've increased our understanding of this region and potentially saved many lives. Well done, my friend. 
Oh, you don't need to burn me up so much. I already love you. You're a Kaldorian. That's all it takes. Wee and such. Alright, I have returned. Uh, so I have one hand in there, one in there. Now oh, that's the uh, heroic. We'll not do that till we get T7. That's the big brain play. Why you got turtles? Why do you both have turtles? What's, the, what's with the turtle party? I want a turtle party. Hello, master. I also found a baby. Hmm. T7 equals sorry for bringing bad news. Hmm. <laughs> and yet somehow Palpatine survived. Go to her. Well, I'll never get energy shield. Oh boy, am I. Oh, he's master. We've only known each other two minutes, but hey, it works. Important secondary mission equals perform high level scan of enemy forces, bound and bounce equals two dangerous for DPS. <laughs> Words. <laughs> T7 equals give Jedi a head start and other stuff, apparently. I will do that on my honor and such. Do that. Lovely. What are you saying, buddy? Uh, T7 equals need to clear path for maximum scan. Jedi equals only hope. He just told me to go out, so clearly I must. Saying, look, if you must do this, you just told me to do this, boy. Excuse me, sir. I dare you. Uh, is it just the one? Oh, we've got two side quests. One's hidden in here? No. Oh, there's hidden behind the vendor thing. Okay, there we go. I did. Don't tell anyone. Ah, oh, little secret. Oh, right. Uh, sorry. Um, don't mind me. Uh, relax. Right. Don't worry, I'm here to help. Yep, yep, yep.
Yeah, I'm on it. I'm on it. Don't worry. Calm your leku. I, I, I wouldn't. How dare you suggest such a thing? Hello, you. Can you sense the pilgrims suffering, Padawan? If not, just look at them. Bloodshot eyes, scarred Leku, exhaustion, and calved into their faces. They're scared for their lives, and for good reason. Flesh Red as attacks are up. Free in the past day. It's just last night they dragged a dozen pilgrims into the darkness. Ah, uh, that's, that's awful. Terrible. There are those of us who try to prevent their suffering. We've been studying the Flesh Raiders and Master Genso. We hope to... Uh, Okay, elucidate the creatures. Pilgrim stories claim the flesh raiders twisted appetite stems from the idols they worship. We've done stuff. Ah, you can read this. <laughs> uh, I will do it. You are welcome. All right, buddy, I'm on it. Don't you worry. Uh, the pilgrims grow nervous. Please examine the idols quickly. Going here, there, and everywhere here. So this is just hand and stuff, so we'll do this first. We'll probably have to go back to the temple at some point. Well, I know we will. So... No rush. I'm already over-leveled for these quests anyway, I think. Oh, yeah. I'm already getting the thingy down. Ooh, Typhus Ridge. The primitive flesh raiders have turned the once lush mountains of Typhus Ridge into a horrific camp from which to launch their raids on other denizens of Typhon. The ground is black and barren, the trees and foliage burned away. The air is thick with a stench of death, and piles of bones desecrate ancient Typhonian pillars. Mute testament to the countless victims of the Flesh Raiders' appetites. Typhus Ridge was never fully studied during the early stages of Typhon's Jedi reoccupation. Master Bestros proposed its use as a meditation retreat, but since then the increasing number of Flesh Raiders has made the exploration impossible. It is unclear whether a small Flesh Raider village was the seed for this now vast settlement, or whether the Flesh Raiders migrated to the Ridge on mass, but either way, for Jedi masters seeking to understand the creatures, further reconnaissance, uh, reconnaissance of the rich is an absolute necessity. Lovely jubbly, bubbly ubbly, tubbly, uh, bubbly. Yep, 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 yep. All makes sense. There's a big head. The man had a very big head. There's a flesh raider head, matey. It's gotta be right. It's too big to be a Twi'lek. Yep, 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 yep. You definitely achieved that. Well done. Proud of you. So, very well achieved. Yep, 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 yep. You know, for final words, they were pretty depressing. You could have done something a bit more exciting, so. She's gonna have them, she's gonna be sad. Uh, hmm. It's the best way to approach this. Do I need to fight you? Do I have a bonus for you? Uh, yeah, cool. Just a random medical droid over there. <laughs> I'll take it. Why not? Why not, eh? Uh, any mankas? Ow. How dare you? Oh. Uh, 
my keybinds aren't what they're supposed to be. Just noticed that. Uh, maybe it's this one I'm supposed to use. Oh, there we go. Nice. That's more like it. There we go. Manka cat. Come here, you. Quite down, but you didn't see nothing. Oh, this is on this now. Oh, move that over. Uh, how many have we got? Uh, I can't. Let's go this way. Come here, you. I need your teeth. Give me your teeth. Oh, a purple. Give me your teeth. Come on. What was the purple? What was the purple? Underworld Syndicate plans. Oh, it's those, th those things. I don't quite understand that reputation. But, um... It told me to do it for the... Battle Pass thing, so... I've handed some in. But I didn't see like a vendor or anything there though. <laughs> Lovely. Uh Okay, we need two more. Two to go. Easy peasy. You a gold boy? No. Are you a gold boy? No. Don't own a care not for you. Can be honest. Are you a gold boy? Nah. Can we get up here? We're being cheeky? <gasps> we can do it. Okay, no loot, I understand. Give me your teeth. Thank you. Oh, I'm so slow. I'm so very slow. Oh, you sneaky by Ow. What's wrong with you, sir? No respect. Excuse me, I must AOE you all. I hope you don't mind. You seem to mind somewhat. Oh man. Oh, hello. Hide in mind huts. How could you? Alright, you belong to me now, okay? As long as we have an understanding. Mm, one to go. Just one more tooth. My kingdom for one more tooth. Excuse me, sir. Hello. Hi. How are you doing? Goodbye. Goodbye, my friend. Yeah, ba da ba dee ba da ba dee ba boop ba doo. Alrighty. Uh, hmm. Okay, we still gotta go up there. Oh, it's the, uh, the kid, right? That's missing. That's what that one is. I remember. I remember. Don't you remember, baby? Yeah. Yes, I do. As I done that I do. Imagine not having connection issues. So imagine what that would be like. Excuse 
Excuse me, I do not wish to fight you. You give me nothing. Therefore, I have no interest in you. I'm afraid that is the way of the world. Nobody said it was good. Oh, God, I'm in a fucking wall. Invisible wall. Yep, yep, yep. You got Rex, huh? Jedi. Oh, yeah, Jedi. No, you got it right. I'm a speaking. Well, he's not been doing much communicating, has he? Are you all right, buddy? Head thing. Not, not a very nice nickname. Now, yeah, first he sets you free. That's no excuse. Well, I didn't mean to go that far. Sounds like bribery to me. I'll try. Alrighty. I was born careful. It's fine. See? Very careful. Got down that hill without a hick. Did you manage, Ari? You did. Look at you. I'm proud of you. I don't want to fight you. You don't want to fight me? It's all good. Oh shit, I need another cat. Uh, you got any cats? Boom's teeth I can pull out? It's nothing personal, I swear. Damn it. Don't concuss me, I need my mind. I'm not using it, but I do need it. How do none of these cats have teeth? What universe is this where the cats don't have the teeth? Oh, oh, I'm not an happy chappy. Give me your fucking teeth. What is this? The tooth fairy has come. Give up all you need. Thank you. And also fuck you. Ah, is this the way up? I don't remember. I done fucked up. No, baby, is this the way up? I don't remember. I done fucked up. I quite like that. Come on. We do not fight. We never fight. Remember that. We are friends. Allies even. We must never yield to that base desire of which is fighting. Okay, except you. You suck. I need you to know that. 
I'm good. Good, good, good. One ledge right in the world. Hello. Ow. Uh, Don't do this to my baby. Cause I think I'm kinda shady. I just hit you with my bat and stick. Yeah, yeah. I did it real motherfucking quick. Oh, yeah, yeah. Look at this guy, he's a pretty big prick. Yeah, yeah. His flesh red is a pretty thick. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello. Come here. No, don't stun me. I wasn't prepared for being stunned. You have to take my personal preparation into account. How rude of you. Just kind of doesn't seem to be a bonus in it, so I'm just gonna click away. You shut down the energy shield protecting the flesh raider command base. Hello. Yeah, yeah, that's me. I... He's not ugly, bless him. Or rude. That's not true. Well, well, self defense. Uh, pride is not a factor. Yep, it's true. I was there, I saw it. And you have? Uh huh. Whatever you say, sir, whatever you say. There will be no sway with me, whatever you say. Do a teleport out there, thank you. Do not wish to be here no more. And I'm a sad panda. My panda is sad. Hey, I did it. Ain't proud of me. Hmm, this idol is about to be recorded to the flesh for this. I mean, they can talk. You could talk to them. Although so far it's only been the four sensitive ones that talk to us, I guess. So maybe not. Maybe not. I do not know. Maybe not. I do not know. How'd I get a lightsaber? <laughs> Bit early for that, innit? Before I've even made one. How peculiar. Jump on a rock. I'm gonna jump up on the rock. Hello. That's my word. I'm so sorry someone called you Spalea. Ah, you found out? Ew. Gross.
Uh, yeah. Just happy to help. Nah. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, you should keep up. Or not, I guess I'll take it. Manka Cat. Fierce Fire uh, Feline Hunters. Manka Cats are believed to have originated on Alderaan, but can now be found on a number of different worlds due to their desirability as exotic pets or trained guardians. It is no surprise that these accomplished hunters have thrived in virtually every ecosystem into which they have been introduced. Sleek and powerful, they have the speed to run down smaller prey, while their massive protruding tusks and claws also allow them to tackle much larger, larger targets. Often traveling in prides, even a lone manka cat can be dangerous, and extreme caution should be exercised when in their territory. Despite the risks, Manka cats are sometimes hunted for sport, and for their tusks and teeth, which are said to possess healing properties. Lovely jabbly. Bubbly bubbly, bubbly 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 You're very welcome. Mmm, I'm yumping around this weird place. Talk to me. Hi there. I'm so sorry. I'm going to be alright. Don't worry, don't worry, I got this. Run a thousand. Well, that's probably true. Yeah. Sorry. But hey. You got to live and die from for a bit. What you always wanted. Apparently. Oh, these things were not supposed to be spouting out poison. Well, they've been at that for a while, I'm just saying. <laughs> they were doing that when I got here. Click. Clicking on things to kill some shit. Now that, now that is that. You gave it your best. And you still lost. Sucks to be you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, sure, 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 sure. Easy squeezy lemon speezy. Hello, fellow Sith. I'm in Jedi. I'm in Sith. Oh. I can undrum. Yeah, Jedi, Jedi don't do rewards. Sometimes. Except when they do. Because I care about people.
Well, I mean, if you insist. Now, who am I to say the news? I suppose. Hello, Master. That is I. Me. Ah, uh, yeah, you won't paddle and talk to me. Hmm. You mean that particularly dangerous place? That definitely seems like the place you should uh, send the paddle in instead of the masters, I agree. I already told you, sir. I was born careful. It's in my blood. My red, 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 pure blood, blood. Yeah, that's a won't. Probably don't want to run into that. I say that, but I did run into it, so clearly I'm not too opposed to it. The more you know. Excuse me, sir, I would like to go to the temple. Thank you for your reminder. I need no more of that. Thank you. No. That is some little calm commun comms, communications. Ew. Lovely. Hello, I am a hero. I've come to destroy your droids. Yep, 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 yep. I'll do it. I'll put my butt into it. Alright, droids, what you got? Hmm? What you got? Come at me. You did not do very well. You too suck. I'm afraid you also are not very good. And you are bad. Oh well. You tried. All abject failures, but you tried. So, uh, yeah. Congrats. No! No! Fuck you, Karma! Fuck you, Karma! Denturi, I was trying my quest into you. Ignore the connection issues, Denturi. You say that, and yet I do not believe you. Nothing I love more than reused dialogue, Denturi. can see why we're such good friends. You and I. Dentary. No, don't do this to me. It would be rude. No, oh, come on. Come on, victory. Victory or victory. Meh. Jump. Jump. Meh. What's going on? My buttons are... Oh, <laughs> I'm targeting the wrong one because of the fucking... Ugh. Lag. No, that's not going to lag, is it? <laughs> in a way. In a way. In a way. Uh, come here, you two. Idiots. Unfortunately, yes. Yeah, there is uh, no. I did a lie. Oh no! Oh no! 
Please forgive me, Yoda. Yep, yep, yep. Sure thing, chicken wing. That's the wrong voice. No, it's not your voice. No, he's been possessed. Terrifying times. Togruta. Togruta that burrito. Oh, that's what that is. Bazooka that Baruka. To grew to that Baruka. <laughs> you have too many trips for my liking, sir. Well, they don't seem to change much. You know, that fucking busy. Asshole. Don't tell Master Steel I said that, please. <laughs> yes, of course, sir. I will do that, my Mary Allen friend. Or are you Mary Luca? One's one and the other's the other, alright? I forget which one's which. They shouldn't have such similar names, it's not my fault. I didn't design them that way. Although I could if I would. I do, yes. Alright, Pally Jim, you, you do that. Let's bang that on. Any quests down here? Not quests, not quests, let's get up. Heading up to the temple, that is where I'll be. Go to bloody quest to do while I am here, yep. Yep, 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 that's a big holographic ball with nothing on it, yay. Sorry, I got some weird news. Yeah, you're not gonna like it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cheeky. Uh, that's why we should help. Well, if I try. Alrighty. I would think so, yeah. Yeah, so, is a un incom <laughs> unconventional one. That's where I was going with that. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, hello. No, oh, I can go to either of you, can I? Well, Jedi Knight. 
Jedi Knights, they're the Order's protectors and defenders. Knights charging into the fray with Force Leap, employing unmatched lightsaber prowess and a tactical use of the Force. Primary attribute. Okay, we don't need to know that. Uh, sure. Yeah, so just buying speed up line. Cool. Well, that means we can do all this now. We're gonna be here a minute. We're just gonna have to accept that. Ooh, it doesn't just spam it on your hotbar anymore. That's nice. Bada bam, bada bam, bam bam bam. Bada bam, bada bam. Dun dun dun. Da da dun, da da dun. Dun dun dun. Bum 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 bum. Bada bam, bada bam. Bum bum bum. Bada bam, bada bam. We're gonna be here on you, baby. We're gonna be here on you, baby. Cause I gotta click on all these things and they just take so long to do. You'd think it'd just be one, but uh, but I. Hey. Fuck me, come on. I have no patience. You should know this about me, game. We've been acquainted long enough. Alright, uh. Collections. Uno secondo. We're gonna need this in a moment. Uh, that's the one. Oh, so where were you? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. If we, if we might give me another codex. How greedy of you not to. Alright, I think we can just teleport now, right? Yeah, let's go here. Yeah. I think that should be fine. I believe... I do, mouse. But do you? Mm -hmm. How far away are you that I will have to move? All right, it's fine. Let's have a look at my vehicles. Uh, what do I want? Ah, oh, there's the one. That's my go-to Jedi one. Oh hi, do you, do you want to fight? I was looking through my menus, but I mean, if you insist. And so be it. Uh, where's the other one? Oh, there we go. I quite like that one too. I do quite enjoy that one. Oh, I've not changed my uh, title, have I? From founder. That's right. I'm a founder. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. Yeah, yeah, hold your horses. I'm talking, I'm talking, you jerk. I mean, I've been doing that anyway, mate. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah what if you get kidnapped again? Yeah, dummy, if I go back to your mom and she's like, Oh, he's been stolen again, and now you have to go to this area to fix him. I'm going to be very unhappy with you. Just throwing that out now. Just, you know. Pretty sure that doesn't happen, but still. Is this an okay way? No. No, 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 no. Getting out of myself. I do believe I'm getting out of myself. Yes. 
Ja, så en död är. I'm running through this beautiful world. It's so goddamn pretty, oh yeah. Am I going to... Yeah, yeah. We good, we good. Well, so they're that I good. Oh, yeah, sorry, yeah, sorry, yeah. Come on. I wish to talk to you as I hop around you. I hope that that is okay with you. None of my damn business, is it? Uh, are these light and dark? <laughs> of course they are. Where's my I don't care option? <laughs> This might just do what you want to do. It's none of my fucking business option. Uh, you know what? You'd be better for that. <laughs> just go find someone else. <laughs> She's getting corrupted. You seem fine. Oh, so like Mark. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, whatever. Let's just pretend this didn't happen. Let's just pretend this whole quest line did not happen. <laughs> I just want my... I don't care. I don't care what you do do. It's your fucking business, not mine. You know, where's that? I don't want to bop my nose in option. It looks like it's not up, but it is up. It's all one big trick, you see. It's just one big trick, yes, sir. Oh, oh. Hello. Uh, excuse me. Where are our conquests? Uh, God. Where are they? I clearly I've missed them at some point. I guess it's in a menu. Activities, maybe. I think I can get that from here, maybe. There's a... Oh, bloody hell. Uh... Uh, take me to the fucking conquest menu. What the fuck? Is... No. Oh. This is the conquest menu? Complete a conquest. Oh, I'm on the season objectives. All right. Some may say I'm a dipshit, but hey, I. I feel like I've gained far more than five uh, five levels at this point. But okay, okay, whatever. I've also completed many conquests. Does oh, it want me to do the whole thing? Oh, okay. I don't know. I never really got into the conquest system. I know it changed not too long ago. There's a quest up there somewhere. With an Aphorian. I remember it. Is that over here? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. 
Ah, oh, sure, 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 sure. It's like one of the only Euphorians in the game. He looks super cool. I like. Why the hysterics? I damn right I did. Well, would you look at that? Keep at it. You're not really making me want to help. Eh, fine. Right, yeah. Fingled. I'm meditating already. Get on with it. So pushy. Don't think I need to meditate to lift your damn rock. To be honest. Rise. Rise for me. Yes. 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 Oh. Are you happy? I did. Why not both? Uh, guess not. Uh, it looks so cool. Uh, doo -doo. Well, you got told, sir. Uh, uh, fine. Do good for my own good. All right. Uh, wow, I did it. <laughs> I did it. Uh, mm. All right. Well, I'm sorry, sir. Nope. All right, buddy. And you. And you too. You're a fucking jerk, Fingold. But you don't, you donkey. What a guy. Uh, hello. I, uh, sure. So on. Sayonara and all that good shit. Jump. I will help. See how I help. Yes. Very, very help. Yep. Don't die, Mr. Zelkaf. 
That's why I'm here. That seems to be a consistent thing, huh? Ah, oh, you're not alone anymore, buddy. I shall stop them, buddy. This music is beautiful. I'm not afraid of no lights here, but don't worry. Well, I guess you can't worry anymore, you're dead. But were you not dead, then, uh, you know, don't worry. It's busy. Would you like my lemons? What's your opinion on lemons, sir? I see. Not very fond of them. I too am not very fond of them. Unless they are mixed up and shipped into aid. Okay. I'm gonna Come to Papa. Come to Papa. I don't know if that big dude's gonna count. Let's see if there's another. My quest of bonusness. Here we go. Lovely. Progress were made. Indeedy, indeedy. Look at you showing off with your lightsaber. Shall not have it, huh? Mine. Oh, hello. I will meet you there. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, the toilet settlement. Alright. Now I am on my way. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, 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 yep. Hello. I found your son, and now I'm here to brag about how he saved him. Let me brag. Uh, how is he? I'm just glad to assist. Unto you, trail. Alright. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Jumping on the cliff tonight. -y. How you doing, buddy? Jedi equals no Master Rogus's location. T7 equals unable to find him. He's supposed to be here. Mm -hmm. Any ideas, Rana?
No, my back. I need that. Oh, how could you? I trusted you, Rana. You're my friend. You're a big old jerk. I'm gonna force persuade you. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah, you should. Get out of here. No, I don't use guns. I got a lightsaber. Why the fuck would I use a gun? You betrayed my master. Mm, I guess. I just, uh, yeah, dedicate yourself to goodness, I guess. I don't really get <laughs> Do what you want. It's your life. You love it. After what you just done? You don't get to say that. Hey, buddy. You'd never betray me. Some of these powerful elements. Hmm. All right. T7, a quirky and surprisingly stubborn astromech with a lively personality and strong independent streak. T701 serves the Jedi by bravely facing danger on a daily basis. Skilled in high-resolution sensor scans, mechanical repair and starship piloting, along with numerous undocumented talents. The droid's hard work is responsible for saving dozens if not hundreds of lives on Typhon alone. Little is known about T7 before the droid came into the service of the Jedi. Certain features of its construction hinted it being a custom model, built some time ago. But there are no official records to, substanti uh, to su substantiate the theory. Despite the uncertainty of its origins, the droid's enthusiasm and willingness to put itself in harm's way leave little uh, doubt as to its loyalty. Very nice. Where are you, T7? Why are you not with me? It's more like it. It's more like it. Get in the party. Do I have your customizations? I do not. Now, back to the Red Cross. Lovely. Lovely jubbly. Now, if we could just function. We would just have a little bit of functioning. Thank you. Thank you. About your graciousness. No, suck on that. Right? I mean, it doesn't matter. They just send me anyway, so. Cool. Let's do this, D7. You can be blue, you can be red, or you can be yellow and purple for some reason. You can be red. You, you match me. Isn't that nice? Isn't that nice how you match me? I know you are ever so happy. Uh, right, let's go on a red journey together. 
Don't do it. Are you scanning me again? What have I told you? What have I told you? Respect my privacy. Check. Boundary issues, T7. Big boundary issues. You make me sad, boy. Uh, hmm. Maybe we should do the heroic first. Mm, well, I mean, it doesn't really matter, does it? Which order we do it? We sink down anyway. Ooh. Yeah, fuck it, we'll go do that first. Why not, eh? Why not? A quest for me, sir. <laughs> I I'd rather not die. Sounds important. Yeah, but I'm not happy about this. Yeah, yeah. Yep, don't worry, I'll crush them all. It's all good. Each and every one of them. I'll, I'll frown while I'm doing it, so that makes it okay. Don't worry, I read the rules. You doing T7 E keeping up? Somewhat. Oh god, I walked into a rock. Who would have seen that coming? Oh, I'm just gonna bypass you guys. Don't mind me, don't mind me. I don't intend to fight. Terribly sorry. I've got an heroic quest to do, you see. Yes, yes, I know. Very fancy. Very fancy. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's further up, isn't it? How dare you? What dare you, sir? Yeah, I remember. I remember. Oh shit. And there's a data cron up there, but I've already got it. Yeah, papa. Ba ba da, ba ba da. Run, dun, dun. Does it? Uh, where's the codex? Uh, data crons. Okay, then do it that way. Typhoon. Let's see. Okay, so you still need to get the crafted one. I don't think that's this one, though. I think that's the last one. I do believe two locations will get those. Species. Fuck knows. Law. Fuck knows. Achievements. Fuck knows. Good start. <laughs> Good start. There are bonus in there because there ain't much for me to fight at the moment. Not got any defensive shit, have I? Excuse me. You could just die, please. Thank you. Very accommodating of you. Oh god, 30. 
I gotta take the fucking things. Alright. Lovely jubbly. Alright, so we have to get four things from these anyway before we proceed. Okay. Is it busy? No, we are not. There we go. There we go. Got there in the end. Uh, let's do this first. This is the way. No, that's the way to a connection -y, a visible wall. Ah, life. Why do you do me like this? The only important question. Nice work, T7. It's just going down a lot quicker since you started uh, popping about. I hesitate to say you might be carrying me. Yep, yep. Go down, baby. Lovely, lovely. This was a perfect time for you to have connection issues, I think. Couldn't think of a better one. No, 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 no. Middle of combat. What could go worse? Show him some help. Oh, my lord. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake, you fucking idiot. Uh, why am I so stupid? Why do I have no sense of direction? Go on, I'll let you have a hit. Okay, T7 did not agree to that, unfortunately. Go on, you jump in. And I will do this. Okay, teamwork. Teamwork to make the dream work, oh baby. Is he coming? No, okay. I'd let him tag them first, but he's not coming. Teamwork to make the dream work, baby. Hello. Mmm, bloody hell. Could probably skip by you, can't I? Yeah, I can. Easy. Bloody easy. Should we, do you want to do this? Yeah, you do. Oh, I got four new abilities. Um, what? <laughs> Why? <laughs> okay, that went down far easier than I expected. Okay. Yeah, man. Yeah. That's what I was gonna say. Ah. Uh...
Lovely. A bit long, in it? Oh, go on then. Go on then, let me hear more. I guess this one. See ya. Goodbye. Uh, okay. What do you think, I guess? Yeah, okay. Okay. I comprehend. I should check my ability, shouldn't I? Uh, cool. Okay. Mm, there, I guess. Oh, is he? You got that for now? That should work. I should be fine. Maybe. You a big boy? You are a big boy. Well done on your bigness. See? Big old crushing. It's okay though, because I'm grimacing. I'm not happy that I'm doing it. But I am doing it. Just remember I'm not happy. That's what matters. No, oh, I'm so sad. No, I'm so sad. Meow. Meow, I see. Oi, don't get angry because I killed your egg. It's part of nature. Horinth. Four legged reptilian predators found primarily on Typhon. Horams typically hunt in large family groups called broods. With their high birth rate, quick matura maturation, and few natural predators, the Horamph population is usually constrained only by a limited food supply. If food supply becomes more abundant in a region, a Horamph matriarch will lay hundreds of eggs, causing her brood's population to explode. As their numbers multiply, the beasts grow bolder and more aggressive. Unchecked, the brood will continue to spread until they finally exceed their food supply, at which point the matriarch will suddenly stop producing eggs. Unfortunately, this return to normal population levels typically only happens after the brood has thoroughly devastated the region. Well, shit. 
Ja, men jag vet inte. Smash a few more ranks, shall we? Because we have to, not because we want to, of course. Oh, hi. I didn't, I thought you were dead, I'm gonna be honest. I thought you were a dead person. Turns out, very much alive. Who would have seen it coming? Clearly not I. I'm yumping here. I'm yumping there. I'm yumping everywhere. Said I'm, I'm yumping here. I'm yumping there. I'm jumping everywhere. Where are you? At least these oxy beasts don't mind, huh? They play nice. Imagine not being an oxy beast. Oh, oh, I'm coming up a hill. What's that coming over the hill? Is it a me? Yes, it is. Uh, Come to Papa. Thank you for coming to Papa. Squeezy peasy. Cheesy easy. Come T7 and RE1. We have work to do. It's me and my drag friends. Oh, there's something I need to do actually. I want to do that. I probably want to do all these, don't I? Just get the... Okay, no, I don't want to do that. <laughs> uh, mail droid there, yep. And repair droid, of course. I got them on my inventory. Uh, field repair, field mail, and the respect thing can just happen, I think. Hello. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> lovely lovely jubbly 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 is this the right way yes it says indeedy So very easy. No, do not even make me sweat. I hope you know this. Alrighty. My question is, do I need to fight you? Must I fight you flesh raiders? Say you a bonus. No. Alright, good to know. Keep away from the flesh raiders. They are 
irrelevant. Nope. Nope. They're irrelevant to the situation. Which is this one. Right here, right now. Right here, right now. What is that? Very cool. Very, very cool. That's a bad boy. <gasps> we must try. We may die, but I are. Okay, well, so far. No, no, why are you alert? There we go. Nice. See how I turn you around? No, oh, fuck it, let's use this. That's right, have a flame fry, get kicked into the balls. Have some rocks, have some lightning. I'm gonna do a yump. It's not explosive. We have some connection issues, it's all good. <laughs> the best part. Oh, fuck. Just trying to see if there's anyone else. Popping in for some fun. He's a big boy, but not big enough. I was a little concerned I wouldn't be able to do these, because, um... I tried doing... One of the veteran mode chapters yesterday for the battle pass thing that they've got in. And I could not do it. It was the one where you have to go with the Senya to talk to the other weirdos. And they test you. Their test killed me <laughs> immediately. So, I was thinking maybe things were a bit harder, but I don't know. I guess I've got no gear at the minute, so maybe that's why. Come here. Okay. Lovely. Thank you, thank you. Uh, uh, we'll just wait for the sneaky Jedi way out. Yep. Oh, you cheeky swine. Come out. Why don't you go throw me around? You have located a data run, an ancient technology once used by the Infinite Empire. This data run contains a blue matrix shard. You combine it with other matrix shards and more words and words and words and words. You ain't gonna leave it on there quick enough for me to fucking read it? I'm not gonna read it. This data run holds unheard of power and knowledge collected by an ancient race. You access its power and discover writings which are clearly only one small piece of a massive galactic history. I feel like reading all these in one big go is the way to go. Of course, I have to get them all first, but still. Since I assume they all sort of lead into one another. There's a story being told. I'm assuming the old race is the Rakata. 
I like the guy to Old Republic, Old Species. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Buddy. Buddy. Don't worry, T7, when Ellie don't. Jesus Christ, T7, keep up. Uh, well, you know what? I'll take it. That's more like it. That is keeping up. I can't deny it. This bloody oxy beast are everywhere. How you doing? I still have not got a clue what you're all about. What the purpose of you is. If there is a purpose for you. I have to assume there is. But to this day, I do not know. Alright. Come here. Fifteen, I think I can handle that. I think we can, I think we got that done with T7. Yeah, yeah. Hello, Droid Army. That's right. Give me all the drums. Give me all of your drums. Yes. Yes. Yes, see? Eh? Freedom! Freedom from the cave. Alrighty. Uh, whatever. Oh, are you gonna do it now? Oh, you also making me so mad. Now, come on. Come on, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. But I believe. I believe. Oh, I'm not sure I believe anymore. My belief is waning. I'm so close to the end. I'm so close. Oh, fuck me. Just let me finish Typhon, please. <laughs> Just give me that. Am I asking too much? God, I got to level 16 here, even without that fucking armor. <laughs> right here. Right there. Right here. Right there. Come to Papa. Come to Papa. Why you not come to Papa? Oh, the music gets me in the good place. Way. Mr. Lotalon, you've been very bad. Those red wrist plates don't go with the rest of your armor. It's a crime against fashion. Tell me why you hate me so. I watched it in a cutscene. Does that count? How about no? Hmm? I say no. See? See my suggestion of no? That's why I brought my thing out. Mm. 
Gavon. Don't hit T7. What the fuck is wrong with you? We got some serious issues, this Bengal. Serious issues. T7, don't scan me in public. God damn, man. Gonna embarrass me in front of the naught alone. Easy, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't feel like you forged me. Bit, bit rude. Kind of arrogant. Uh, no. Yeah, I think I'm going to say no. Yeah, the whole Jedi thing, kind of. Yeah, um, punch in the face. Punch in the back of the head. Give you a concussion. I'm sorry. You're asking for it. Literally pining for a concussion. It's your own fault. Where have you gone? Where's your concussion? Rude. Well, that didn't take long. Not sure you really taught me anything to begin with. Oh, thank you, Master. Well... What about the one I buy on the store? Does that count too? Oh, thanks, T7. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll do all the work. Don't worry. I'm used to it. You have taught me well in that regard. I'll give you that. The Forge, since re the rebuilding of the temple, the very best of the young Jedi have braved the pass through the mountains, hoping to make their first lightsabers at the monument known as the Forge, the ancient Typhonians' site for crafting or mending weapons grating. When the Jedi returned to Typhon, they had only scraps of information on the Forge's location. It took ten months before a small team finally discovered it overgrown by vines and half buried by a landslide. Despite the Forge's power, many Jedi have sensed a strange darkness or corruption in the region surrounding the Forge. The local beasts are unusually vicious, and the weather often changes without warning. These phenomena mean only the most skilled and combat-ready Padawans are ready, uh, encouraged to seek out the Forge. This is the ancient forge where millennia of Jedi have constructed their lightsabers. Don't Tootin. Nah, nah, not you. You're not a lightsaber or a Jedi. Get out of here. Yes, 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 definitely. Uh, maybe. I can't promise that, I'm gonna be honest. I'm probably gonna give you another one pretty much immediately. I'm sorry. I have no choice. Well, I do have a choice. That's a lie. You're just not going to like the choice I make. Need more screenshots. <laughs> huh? Lovely. You are mine now. 
Your destiny is to rest within my... Uh, <laughs> within my chest thing forever. I hope you'll be proud. Don't throw a fucking rock at me. What the fuck? You threw a rock. Oh, wait, no. I choose you. Uh, let see. Oh, go away. There we go. Yas. 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 Lovely. Or to a grand start. Come on, you. I'm gonna lightsaber you in the face. Ow, that's my face. What the fuck? Oh, stop it. Stop it. You're hurting me. <laughs> okay. Get yeah, right, the bonsai. No, don't stun me. That's rude. Thank you, T7, for saving my life. Never will I forget. Never will I remember. Success. The greatest of success. Yeah, lovely. Yeah, yeah, we did a real terrible thing here. Kiss my red anus, so. It's evil, BD. Why are you so evil, BD? Ugh. Dairy, dairy me. Me, me, dairy. Yeah, da, 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 that's some lag, and I don't know why it's that, but it is so well. <laughs> What's that, buddy? Health equals better. You darn too, and it does. All right. No, oh, I can do this. I can do this. I'm telling you right now, I can do this. I can't do much, but I can do this. Watch as I can do this. I not only can, but will. You got this T7? I'm cheating by bringing you with me. Don't mind, there's nothing. It's cool, Mr. Droid, I can do fire too. What do you think about that? You big old donkey. Ooh, let me have a look, see. Well, I don't need to see what that looks like, do I? Bit excessive to be reading that one, I think. 
Okay. Ready to go, go. And I just let you know now. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, that's... Well, now you know. Thank you, thank you. Take my certification and I'll go, thank you. Mm. I can only say thank you so many times, so perhaps it's time you cease with the ass kissing. Was that, buddy? You were right. Jedi Temple equals T7's favorite place in Typhon. Not a lot to choose from, really, is there? I think I did all the side stuff. I do believe. This is all finito. Now you can come to T7, you don't have to stay back there. Oh, well, I guess you're there now, okay. Okay, damn it. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I'm great. Don't mind me. Uh, they need your support, obviously. You big donkey. Surely you should have known that, you know? You heads of Jedi. You cannot come to that conclusion before, sir. So. Oh, Jerry, thank you. I was not a bad one for very long, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'd love to have you around D7. I like. Hmm. Oh, very best thing. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'm ready to go, sir. Yeah. Well, that's uh, side quests. I think. Com T7, don't you stand there? Knight of the Republic. You earn this title on Typhon after confronting Bengal Moor and then constructing your first lightsaber. That's true, I did. Well done. Well done, Codex. Congrats on keeping up. Uh, planets. Typhon. Okay, I think this is right, because this one, I think you get elsewhere. For some weird reason, you can't get it on this planet. Oh no, I'm missing two. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know what the other one would be. Clearly I didn't beat something up. Uh... Beastiery. 
So, there is a way to figure this out. There is a way. Life on. No, right. <laughs> Spell that wrong. I spell it wrong again. Oh, boy. Bestiary Codex. Uh, what have we got? Gid, we got lamb, so Horinth, yeah, Manka Cat, and Typhonium, so we didn't get Oxy Beast. And you go to 96925. It's the Wingmore I can't get there, I'm pretty sure. It's supposed to have gotten Zabrak. Oh. Zabrak, a near human sentience from the planet Iridonia. Renowned for their independence and wandering spirit, they have distinctive facial horns. Those number and pattern de uh, denote which subspecies an individual Zabrak belongs to. Most Zabrak wear rit uh, ritual facial tattoos, which vary from simple lines to more elaborate patterns. The design can mark significant events in their lives, and merely be a matter of personal preference. After discovering space travel early in their civilization, they quickly colonize worlds throughout the mid-rim and get a reputation as pioneers and explorers. Zabrak are also skilled warriors engaging in inter-clan competitions to hone their uh, talents and their physiology, which includes a secondary heart and some resistance to pain. It gives them surprising endurance in battle. I'm not sure why that would be surprising. Okay, this will be interesting. Uh, minus 96, minus 925. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Am I supposed to find that? Uh, uh, minus 96 is around here, minus 925 would be up here. So around about there. Yeah. Fuck it. Let's see. I don't know how I would have missed something up there. Might as well finish it up. There's only one to get. Cause I'm, I remember I've tried doing this before and the wing more one. You don't get on this planet. Which again, begs the question why it's in the codex for this planet. But, you know. Whatever. Who am I to judge? Well, me. And I am judging. So. <laughs> I'm most definitely judging. Uh, yeah. Ba -ba -ba, ba -da -ba, ba -da -ba. So what are they called? Oxy Beast. The Oxy Beast. So, I have to find a specific Oxy Beast around here and walk up to it. How random. Especially considering how many Oxy Beasts I have walked up to. At this point. Uh, let's see. Uh, well, I mean, it should be around here somewhere. Ah, oh, there we go. Now we're in them. Uh, yo, give me your codex entry. What, what the hell? Codex me. 
Scarlet X me. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> I guess it's not that one. <laughs> Maybe this one. So weird that it has to be a specific one. Oh, don't disconnect now. I'm so close to the end. There we go. How weird. Oxybeast, deceptively aggressive. Oxybeast are uh, mammalian herbivores with a multitude of horns covering their shaggy bodies. They are believed to originate on Typhon, but have been found in small numbers on other planets. Evidence of their migration of the first Jedi long ago. They typically travel in herds and are quite capable of fending off would-be predators. The pointed spines on their backs prevent attackers from pouncing on them. And a charging oxy beast is capable of inflicting all kinds of bodily harm. Oxy beasts are generally ill-tempered and unpleasant around people, but they can be tamed to a degree. Domesticated oxy beasts will imprint on a single individual, whom they are unquestionably loyal to, while remaining hostile towards everyone else. Mm, lovely, 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 jubbly. Ooh, baby, baby, baby. Nice, that's everything but one. We can pretty much call Typhon complete, I think. I guess, uh, oh, it'd be a legacy one, uh, legacy. Typhon is 100% complete. Yep. How proud of me am I? Not very much, but still. I will take it. And hold it close to my heart. Ooh, baby, 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 baby. Baby, baby, mama, mama, baby. Alright. Alrighty. Well, if we're no longer a paddle one. Oh, we are going up. Oh, Jesus, that light. I think it's time for a change in style. So a Jedi Knight, like I always change our title to. I'm not a measly I don't want any longer. I am. Sukat Jesu, Knight of the Republic, the galaxy's finest. Nope, that is me. We do a jump. Stretchy, 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 baby. So long, Typhoon. I love you. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. Oh. Ooh, that's new. Oh, it's new for me. Are you fancy? I don't know if the lack of sound effects there were intentional. <laughs> I feel like that might have uh, propelled it to even greater heights. Sure it wasn't. Alright. Okay, lovely. We can, I think, I do believe. I can do this now. Warning, changing this will update your current... Oh, no, 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 no. Do this. And then this. Yay. Boom. Oh, I've got... <laughs> I didn't even cotton on to the fact that I've got two tanky ones. Uh, infiltration or serenity. I think we're going to go infiltration. I don't know. I don't know what the difference is. To be honest, I'll have to uh, have to look. Uh, okay. Wait. <laughs> Fuck off. Why is it? I didn't activate it. That's why. Okay, there we go. That's that. And then this we activate. <laughs> I got no glory sound, but that's fine. <laughs> Alright. Put that back on. <laughs> 
don't look at me. Don't look at me. Uh, yeah. Do I want to be vigilance? <coughs> oh, pardon me. So we don't make a choice until level 23 of them. I mean, I don't know. I guess I want to be vigilant, so I don't. Damage over. Oh, no. You know what? No, I don't. <laughs> I don't. Can I not have a look at it without changing it? Oh, sure, whatever. I don't just want to have... Because this is... I might be on focus on my uh, sentinel. That's what's concerning me. I don't just want it to be the same. It's not really changed much here, at least. It has. Yeah, because that's a spell I've got on my... Yeah, we'll stick with Vigilance. We'll do it. We'll stick with Vigilance. I'm not a big fan of dot specs, but... I'll deal with it. Uh, what's it? That shouldn't be. Ah, uh, oh, you're what I'm missing. Okay. Yeah, that looks right. Alrighty. Well. Fun times, a fun start to our journey. Next time we do all the random shit we have to do on the space station. And then to Coruscant. We and we'll do some PvP, I don't know. Might end up doing that flashpoint. I'll probably do the flashpoint. But yeah. Thank you for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed. I did. And shall see you next time. Goodbye.